hello everyone you're welcome back to my channel um if you're visiting my channel for the first time please don't forget to subscribe um, and um click on the notification bell um in today's class i want to show you guys how to cut um a palazzo jumpsuit a palazzo jumpsuit and it's not gonna have um half cut joining here that's on the waistline it's not going to have um half cut joining you understand and it's gonna have little cape at this part so i want to use this um diagram to illustrate how it's gonna look like after cutting so that you understand more better so this now you need your shoulder measurement your arm hole measurement arm hole yeah it's your shoulder you still need your bust measurement you understand you still need your waist measurement yeah we don't really need under bust you understand you need your waist measurement and you still need your hip measurement in this place you understand so now but one thing you need to have at the back of your mind because it's gonna be um a free jumpsuit a very free jumpsuit you understand so all this your measurement you are going to have 33 inches that is your bust your waist then your hip you are going to add 33 inches but all this one you are going to do your normal um, body measurement um probably the zip is going to be because it's going to be an armless jumpsuit so the zip is going to be at the side you understand you can fix the zip at the side so meanwhile another thing you need to understand is you still need to take your measurement from your shoulder to your waist you understand you still need to take your measurement from your shoulder to your waist then you are still going to take your crotch measurement normal so that it will enable you to calculate the distance from here to here very well you understand so you i believe we all know how to take um um what is it called that is if you watch my my last video on how to make pants i tell us how to take measurements or uh, how to take crotch measurement so you are going to place your tape here on the waist line you understand that you measure it to this surface that um, the person is sitting on that is how you get your um crotch measurement or you can as well measure like this place your tape here on the waist like this then you go like this all the way around you understand through the back place your tape here then you go all the way around through the back to get your crotch measurement you understand so you are going to get your measurement from shoulder to half length then you are going to get your crotch measurement from waist to to that flat surface the person is sitting on or you measure around like this so whatever you have here you are going to add it to whatever you measure it that is for the crotch you understand you are going to add them together to determine where you start this your core from because as i told you earlier it's not going to have joining here the down part is not going to have joining here and it's not going to have this joining too you understand it's a cut together palazzo jumpsuit so for instance now you fold your fabric like this this is your this is your shoulder this is your arm hole you understand mark out the neck take your bust measurement your waist then this one is just going to come like this so this down part now can be around 12 it can be around 12 or 15 15 inches you understand so that uh this stuff uh, i told you to measure from here to here then from here to here, add them together so that it will enable you to calculate your shoulder to crotch so you are going to measure it from here maybe somewhere around here then you're just going to cut a little bit like this you're just going to cut a little bit like this you understand so i i believe you understand with this illustration when i cut more on the fabric you are going to get it more So all you need to do now is get the um, the length of the fabric you want to use. We are cutting both the front and the back together. So this is the measurement I'm going to use. That's my shoulder, 15, bust, 40, waist at 7, hip 44, then the full length is 50. So now, I just like I said initially, I'm going to add 3 inches to the bust, waist and the hip measurement because you know it's going to be a free palazzo jumpsuit. It's going to be free, it's not going to be fitted. You understand? 
so now i've already done my shoulder slanting 1.5 inch downward then if you look at the back too the back is um 1.5 inches higher than the front so it's the normal thing we've been doing all this while so now this is the um shoulder measurement divided by two then from that part you are going to measure seven inches downward for the ham hole seven inches downward for the ham hole so now i'm going to measure my boss point i'm going to get my boss point which is 10 inches the underboss um, is 14 inches but you know i did not put uh, we are not making use of underboss here so just my waist from my shoulder to the waist is 16 inches then the shoulder to the boss point is um 10 inches waistline so now um the crotch the crotch is, is um 13 inches the crotch here is 13 inches mind you it's not going to have joining on this waist part but you need that waistline to cut so that you'll be able to calculate your um um cr uh, crotch length so from that place downward now is 13 inches So if you measure it all through to that place now you get your crotch so this is um our hip length to get our hip line from shoulder it's either 24 or 25 it can be 26 also depending on how tall the person is so my hip line is 25 inches this is waist this is bust You understand so now you are taking the the bust measurement plus three inches then you divide by four then you had the two inches so in allowance i've already done that to so just cover your arm hole in this case you don't really need to measure your lap measure take your lap measurement you understand but if you want to you can still do it but you know it's a free stuff so i don't really think it's necessary because automatically the dress is big as in the jumpsuit is big on its own so on this crotch liner that is where we are going to start our curving from so this down part you can just measure either 1.5 or 2 inches i'm using 2 inches here it can also be uh, 1.5 so just look at where i'm going to cut it so just cut it a little bit like that so if you look at the jumpsuit now it's not having that crotch joining at the front and even the waistline is not having any joining so if you want to now you can take your lap measurement on this crotch line but if you don't want to do that just go down straight and the down part depends on how wide you want the down part you can make it 12 you can make it 15 you can make it 16 17 it doesn't have um a fixed measurement so depending on how wide you want it so yeah, making use of um, 16. I'm making use of 16. So I'm just I, I I've cut it out, and um this palazzo like this. If you want to add zip at the back, you can actually do that. You are still going to follow the same process, but from this crotch part upward. You're just going to leave that normal two inches um two inches allowance for the zip then when it gets to that crotch line you're still going to cut the same way that is if you want it to have zip then if you don't want it to have zip then this back part just cut like um just cut like um cut like four inches down so that the um the head will be able to penetrate to it yeah, this back part now you can just cut four inches downward so that the head will be able to enter it or preferably you can put zip if you want so it's a very easy stuff so all you need to do now is just place the front and the back join the side down you start joining with like two inches or 1.5 at the upper part but when you get to this hip line and the crotch line you reduce it to one inch place it on each other 
join the fold the down part join the crotch the crotch part too so just join it just join it then join the side join the shoulder you know it's an uh it's an armless uh, jumpsuit you can just they are going to pipe the they are going to pipe the arm all so it's having little cape it's having little cape on this front part so just place it like this to cut out the cape place like this to cut out the cape so you now determine how wide and how deep you want the cape to be So here is 2.5 inches then the down part is um, 4.5 inches so that is how wide I want the cape to be your own if you want it wider or you want it smaller you can do that on your own so after cutting like this just uh, just shape it a little bit at this front part you know it's like this baby cape so now you are going to cut another two pieces of this, then you turn, you are going to turn it. So after turning it, you just place them on it like this. You place it on it like this, then you join it. You tag it around and use a uh, bias to pipe it in, then your jumpsuit is ready. Thank you very much everybody for watching. Please don't forget to share and subscribe.